A busy Sunday on both of the diamonds at UL. The baseball and softball teams taking to the field for opening weekend play. News 15 Sports Director and our Real Raging Cajun Will Heron brings us all the action. Was well, a much better day than Saturday's chilly affair out here at Teague Moore. You guys lost that game to Wright State 7 to 6. They look to try to pick up the pieces and have a better outcome on Sunday. Now the ladies look to stay dominant against Baylor as they took them on in a doubleheader. On the mound for the Cajuns was Carson Fluno in his first start of the season. Helping him out is Jose Torres, who guns down Boston Smith, caught in the act of stealing. It would be reviewed and upheld. Fluno would sit down three batters in four innings of work. Bottom of the second, Connor Higgs getting a board for the Cajuns. Duncan Pastore up next. He would get some good lift on this one out to center. Wouldn't be enough, but would be plenty of time for Higgs to tag up and take second. Like a beast, John Taylor takes a pitch to put runners on first and second. This wild pitch would move both of the runners into scoring position. Two outs, Luke Juhas at bat. He would get around on it, but wouldn't be enough in the inning would end. Top of the second with two on, Fluno in a jam. He'd use his arm to get himself out of it. Bases loaded now, his bestie Torres bailing the team out as he makes this pop-up catch near the screen look routine. Bottom of the third now, Trey LaFleur gets distance on it, but it would just drop before the wall. Cajuns take it five to three. No Lamson Park. This one not as pretty as Friday. Cajuns down six to nothing in the bottom of the seventh. Dariana Orme on the mound. Two Baylor pitchers would combine for five strikeouts in this one. Victoria Valdez falling victim here. Sam Rowe at bat next, trying to get something started. She'd slap this one through the hole to take first base. Two outs with the runner on. Laney Crater would pinch hit. But it wouldn't matter. Warm stuff was just nasty. Well, the guys are back in action as they head over to McNeese at Lake Charles on Tuesday. Ladies also in action on the same day. They're taking on LaTeX here at Lamson Park. Well, I am here at Teague Moore. Your real raging Cajun, Will Heron, News 15.